Uh, just a quick uh, video, guys, asking yet another question. It was on Napoleonics the other day, and now it's on Space Marines. There's not, not a bad difference, is it? Uh, as you know, I don't do a lot of this type of work, games workshop and that, and I, what I do is, well, what I've been trying to do is improve myself. Uh, so I've been doing these on the side. Um, it's a lot to go on the blue. I'm, it's taking a few nights just to get this far. Uh, so please forgive the paint job. Uh, yeah, he's going to be an ultramarine. Yeah, I know, Gav's, Gav's type of colours. But uh, again, it's I'm practising for different things, to be honest with you. Um, my question is, this shield here, or pauldron, I'm not sure what you'd call it. Uh, he's a primaris. I've painted him, as I say, as an as a ultramarine. Can I make up my own design on this the one i've seen most seems to be the most popular is is yellow on this side with like three little they're almost like birds to me uh, like silhouettes of seagulls uh, then there's a diced piece here and like a red number one or what i'm not sure what people have done on it to be honest with you and then the other one it looks like a uh, a decal and uh it's just like some writing on a blue background, some white writing. Can I do my own on that? Or have I got to stick? I mean, I have been genuinely looking at artwork and everything, and I can't really, the odd ones I've seen are more or less showing what these people are painted. Uh, can I just make my own up on that? Or has it got to be exactly the same? I, I, I know I'm just, and I'm just practicing here, so I could, could do whatever I liked, and I might verge on that, but I don't want to start getting all the, all the people that really know this subject, I don't want to get start getting up people's noses. Um, and also, I'm doing this again just to teach myself non-metallic and that on these different different things. I was thinking of having, like, say, a red skull there, and then the gold-looking non-metallic uh, wings for the emperor. Uh, can can I do that, or has it all got to be um, non-metallic, gold-looking? That makes sense. I think that was all the. Yeah, I think that's everything I was uh, I was going to ask you. So yeah, if if anybody's kind enough to to know the answers, because I, you know me, I in my mid fifties, and I I know about, I know bits and pieces of obviously games of forty k and. Age of Sigma and all this type of stuff, but only very, you know, small bits. Uh, but I do enjoy. I'm getting more enjoying. Uh, I want to. I want to paint other stuff if that makes sense, apart from just my historicals. Um, so I was just wondering, uh, you know, can you help me out? Because I, I I don't know. I've got one book, and that's a. I bought a very cheap second-hand codex on Space Wolves. Is I plan to do it. What I'm trying to do is do like shiny armor. Um, this is very basic at the moment, and I've left it fairly basic because obviously he's got to have arms on. He's going to have a great. This guy's got a great big shield, um, so there's going to be lots of shadow areas I've got to put in. So at the moment, it's really just getting a, a base and learning what blues work type of thing. And then uh, once everything's on, then I'm going to try and bling it up more and put more deeper shadows in where they've got to be. Um, that's the idea, and I've got a prop. Have I still got him here? One minute, you'll hear me rolling the off across the room. This is what I do: is I just buy these these one-off sprues that people sell um, on eBay. I think I got this guy for three quid with a delivery. Uh, again, I. I that they're all these Primaris, which I take it the Primaris Marines are the latest incarnation, are they? Um, I, I, from what I've been listening to podcasts and stuff, they're slightly taller, are they? Or skinnier or something? Um, so I, I thought I might be doing one of these as the... Uh, oh, what were the yellow ones called now? Nah, it's gone. Sorry, guys. We may have problems. Memory memory retention ain't always good at short short term. Uh, so yeah, uh, these are what I do. I get these, and um, I'll say that guy hasn't got a a, a base. I'll, I've only stuck. I've I've literally got him 
pushed in at the moment to uh, uh, just to paint on. And I've actually I normally paint on on my corks, but I've actually I've got a cheap Citadel Mark II holder just to try out. That's coming. Um, it was on a discount because uh, I, I I'm never a big fan of painting on blue tack and white tack. It, it's it's it, I've had too many bits where where figures have flown off. Um, and sometimes I'll just drill the feet to these guys and stick them in my, my cork bung, but uh, I, I, I fancy just sticking them on that. And probably the same for this guy. Uh, but yeah, that's what I do. I just buy the odd sprue. I mean, I'm not into buying a, a whole box of the guys. I, I do it for the love of the enjoyment of painting. Uh, but of course, I, I haven't got the, the money to suddenly start buying codexes and 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 I, I did. I have bought a few uh, Games Workshop uh, novels. Uh, they're all obviously I get them cheap, so they're all the 1990s ones. Just getting rough ideas because I just don't know enough of the law to, you know, Star Wars and that. I'm I'm quite up on, but but the grim dark future where there's any war, uh, not so much. Um, so uh, yeah, grim dark future and Gav's trying to push himself to painting a shinier <laughs> space marine. I just like shiny space marines. I've never seen him painted, and I wanted to teach myself, which I can't do on my my historicals and I want to do some Age of Sigma as well. I just want to try different stuff as a painter if that makes sense. I think you get stale if uh, you know. So sorry uh, I'm digressing again aren't I but yeah that that so can I do this shield um, are they particular to a particular company of the Space Marines uh, or Ultramarines you know um, or can I just do my own and say it's this guy's particular shield or have I got to stick to doing what everyone else is doing uh, I have seen some of these done in silver non-metallic or metallic and obviously I've seen him with the with the gold metallic for want of a better word but I just thought yeah um, he might uh, he might look good with a with a red skull the other thing I, I haven't got the blooming head uh, it's in the drawer I've got to look for it actually because I couldn't find it it's gonna look great with no head on uh, I've seen, seen them with like a red band on top of the helmet so I just thought if I had the red band on top of the helmet uh, I could maybe do this red as well it was it was just a thought and I might I even thought of doing this guy down here red as a and and you know just shake it up a bit uh, but I'd be grateful if anybody knows because um, I'm I'm out way out of my comfort zone and my depth with it with this type of stuff so thank you very much uh, much appreciated and we'll see each other soon on another video.